Heroin is plaguing many Northeast Ohio communities, but tonight the mayor of Avon Lake is taking action. He's concerned about the impact on the community, including crime. Shea Harris is live on five with a closer look at this problem. Triple since last year. Tonight, Mayor Greg Zilka says it's time to face the disease head on. The reality is we have a number of young people who are, whose lives are being cut short. Avon Lake Mayor Greg Zilka says Lorraine County has a serious problem, heroin, and it's time to face it. We started um, seeing a number of deaths in the community. The obituaries became very evident going to the wakes and the funerals of these young people became very disheartening. The statistics for last year, 2012, we, left, we lost 60 people to overdoses in Lorain County alone. To give you a comparison, in 2011, that number was 22. Chemical Dependency Director of Psyche and Psyche, Marva Jones, says initially the victims are given addictive prescription drugs for medical purposes. Because of the cost of keeping up with using the prescription meds, then they end up using heroin. But Jones and Mayor Zilka hope to get in front of the problem by educating the community on signs to look for in their loved ones in a public meeting at the library tonight. Lorraine County is about 300,000 people, but if, if we had 60 people die of influenza. We had 60 people die of auto accidents in Lorain County. We would be marching on City Hall and outraged. Unfortunately, signs of heroin's power has already been seen not only in deaths, but also crimes. In, in, in most of the breaking and entering cases that we have had in this community, uh, a vast majority of those are related to uh, drug abuse and people trying to pick up quick money. Now, Jones says the state of Ohio passed the pill bill last year to get rid of pill mills in the area for irresponsible doctors. She says doctors should be monitoring patients closely to make sure they're not abusing prescribed drugs. Also, Mayor Zilka says they will have health care professionals on hand tonight to help families already in crisis. Live on 5, I'm Shea Harris.